for a TFC side that lost that last game against Vancouver at home. Rooney tracking back, and that's one of the things that some people wondered about when Wayne Rooney was brought to DC United. And he goes about it the same way, he loves the game. Incredible appetite. Acosta and Rooney linking up there, and it's Luciano Acosta finds Nick De Leon here down the right side. Running against Nick Hagland, De Leon's ball in, and it's saved by Bono as that one took a deflection off Hagland on the way through. Almost managed to sneak in by the post. Yeah, I thought it was just going to squirm in that near post. De Leon with a little rollover on the studs. And Hagland gets that clip, and Bono is actually really helped by that post of his just to squeeze the ball between his later on tonight the white caps are sporting kansas city one of the game going on right now seattle just taking a very early lead in orlando bradley's ball in handsome with the header and bill hamid who recently returned to dc united and major league soccer after time in europe what a game it was that night when it finished 4-4 crazy ending to that match There's a Costa from distance, drilling it well wide. What a difference it must be now for Ben Olsen. When we spoke to him at Beano yeah. Field back in June, he seemed a little bit despondent about DC United and where they were at. They were bottom of the Eastern Conference at that time. Hadn't had a great start to the season. And lots of road games as they were waiting for the stadium to be opened. And of course, he knew in the back of his mind Wayne Rooney would be a right. Just have to do their job and try and win a big... Canadian match up on Sunday and then go to New England the last game of the season with two victories and really put the pressure on DC and Columbus. Montreal one point behind DC United right now. This is DC's game in hand. But as you Hansen giving chase here as it's headed away by Brion and DC keeping it in on this near touchline. Stieber gets it back from Acosta. Now it's Shamil Assad. Bradley in with the foul there, and it's free kick in a central position here for DC. Yeah, Steeper has some lovely feet. Really does really well at caressing the ball. Look at this. Just keeps his body between Michael Bradley and the football. Michael Bradley can only bring him down. I think with Ariola missing because of obviously the death of his dad, they miss a bit of thrust to the attacking play look they have a costa who can run with the ball but steeber and assad pretty similar rooney's not going to run past people anymore i thought that on saturday when i watched the match against dallas just a little bit static not a lot of movement you can see that in the early stages rooney and steeber stand over this one it's a long long way out in the 18th minute as rooney goes for goal stunning from wayne rooney and dc united take the lead the man who has given DC all the momentum down the playoff push has done it again. As Wayne Rooney reaches double figures in goals in his first MLS campaign. Well, how many times have we seen him do this in the red of Manchester United in the white of England? Just an absolutely brilliant goal from Wayne Rooney. The DC United captain in the black this time of... His new city, DC, just bends it past Bono. He has no chance. He's fully stretched, just can't get up to it. Such is the precision and the power of Wayne Rooney's free kick. What a moment, a match with very little in it. The opening goal just coming from a moment of genius from one of England's greatest strikers. That's why he's here, folks. That's why DC United wanted to bring in someone like Wayne Rooney, a game changer, a match winner. In fantasy GM, <laughs> and you can either take Zlatan or Wayne Rooney. It's a tough one. I'll give you a few moments to think about it. <laughs> 20 minutes gone, DC United 1, Toronto FC 0. Here it is again, look at the way he curls his foot around the ball, dipping, swerving. It's outside the post, just coming back all the way. Tough one for Bono because he knows that he United at the moment. Bradley and Liam Fraser just almost alternating between who's the deepest midfielder. This goes from distance and wasn't going to trouble Alex Bono from there. <laughs> I've also seen him do that before from the halfway line last season, was it against West Ham? Josie Altador, Gregory Van der Will amongst those. Watch. Goes back for Durkin. 
Durkin over the top, it's an opportunity here, the flag's up, Hassan finished it beautifully. But he'll turn his head to the assistant referee and see the flag raised. What a lovely finish. Brilliant finish from Assad. I think it's tighter than it maybe looks. Here we see it. It's very close, probably on his body. Offside, looks like his feet are on. What a finish. I think he knows he's offside, so that's why. He... The three man wall just being lined up by Alex Bono. Costa hovering around there, but no, he's not taking it. Look, I think Rooney's just going to move <laughs> this to the side, and well, maybe he's just going to hit it direct. Wayne Rooney already has one tonight from a free kick. Two minutes before half time, Acosta leaves it. It will be Wayne Rooney. This time he goes for the left corner and off target. Yeah, it was never as half. Rooney with seven assists already in his MLS career. This one comes into the box off the bar as the header came in. I think it might have been De Leon. Wasn't far away from making it two and giving Rooney another assist. On. Now Lucho Acosta over the top. Can Wayne Rooney get there? No, it's through towards Bono who almost gifted it back to the England record goal scorer. Gatman puts the... Whistle to his lips, and it is half time. All the second half, Luke and Stephen. Gentlemen. Thanks, Kelsey. Wayne Rooney, the difference between these teams in the first half. Rooney there just having a conversation with Jordan Hamilton on halfway as this. Moore heads that one straight towards Acosta. It's rolled through for Wayne Rooney. Rooney now with a chance to get his second of the night. Rooney cutting back inside as TFC got the bodies back. Rooney chipping it up back post. Acosta just feeds him in. Big chance. Took too long in the end, indecisive. You expect him just to hit it here. 18 yards out. No, it's not. It's layoff positioning because they're already eliminated. Morrow chipping it in towards Hamilton. Punched away by Bill Hamid. In the US capital. And Wayne Rooney's goal has DC in front. It came in the 18th minute. Rooney over this free kick as he curls the ball in. And climbing high there, it was burn bomb, but a bit of pushing in the box. And a free kick goes the way of Toronto. Just a couple of minutes. Inside the final 20 here at Audi Field. DC United 1, Toronto FC 0. Ashtiba has it here. Roll into the path of Rooney. And then Hagland gets back and causes Bono to have to chase back and make sure that one goes over. Maybe one pass too many from Wayne Rooney. Ashtiba just get. Birnbaum chasing across to the far side, having come forward from the back for the set piece. Stieber. De Leon couldn't get there. Fraser did, and then Rooney drives it forward. As Liam Fraser's header away fell right at the boot of Rooney, who was looking to get his second of the night. Carus does really well there against Dauro. It's Rooney once more here. This ball into the box, it drops to Rooney. Gets on target, Bono looked like he's a little bit confused about how that was coming him, but doesn't quite get makes a good save. Holds on to it. Segura for Stieber is the first change. I think it's been an nervy performance from DC United Luke. I don't think they've been that confident. Just want to grind it out and get to the victory rather than they would have to hope that the crew lose their last couple of games though and that Montreal can win their last two, but See, United could be out of sight by the weekend if it stays like this, and depending what happens. This is a cost. Yeah, at the start of the game, we talked about the silly mistakes. Look, there's going to be another one there. Rooney again, brilliant little flick. There's a Costa. Tricky little player. Hagelin, hey, Zavaleta, sorry. Tries to go back to Bono. It's really tight, short of the back pass. Costa's right. Given away by Fraser as this one is played downfield, and Rooney fouled by Zavaleta. Zabaleta, yeah, they have allowed 10 goals in the final 15 minutes of matches this season. Michael Bradley standing over the free kick here. Hagland forward from the back as it's played into the middle. And maybe one 
last chance for TFC to get it forward, but the two minutes of stoppage time is up. DC United's charge towards the playoffs continues. And Wayne Rooney is the match winner. He did it in fabulous fashion with a world-class free kick 18 minutes in. It's a fourth straight win for DC United.